Ogden Judo is a nonprofit organization, and the monthly fee that the members pay goes towards making sure we can keep use of the building and our supplies are all in stock. And sometimes we do have to pay out of pocket for that. Sometimes it can be pretty hard to do because of a lot of administrative work, but mostly just going down there every night. I'm Dale Yonatani. I'm a fourth degree black belt. Been doing judo for 57 years. He whipped and pulled himself out here. So this is where he got stopped. He just throwing his leg, he went here and was get to him. But it's a sport that anybody can do. And you don't have to be the champion. You can just do it for funds. Judo is something that's been in our family for a long time, so it feels right when we take that and we share it with other people down at the dojo. Judo's great! All right! Great! My name's Tyson Fielding. I've been doing judo off and on for 30, almost 30 years. Um, the reason why I uh, keep doing judo is to be able to help and inspire young individuals to do better and just to um, continue anything that they, they love. My name is Jim Etoll. I've been involved in judo for about 34 years. I don't participate on the mat, but I've had five sons that are in judo. And it's been a great sport. It teaches you discipline. It teaches you honor to those instructions that you have. And it teaches you lifelong principles that you'll never, ever lose. My name's Lurling Coggins, and I've been in the sport of judo for 34 years. And some of the things that keep me in it are, it's just a good, fun physical activity, keeps you active, and great people to work with. My name is Dennis Yonatani. I'm a fourth degree black belt, and I have been doing judo almost all my life with the Ogden Judo Dojo. I've been, um, I like judo because, I don't know why, it's fun, and you can learn a lot. You learn a lot about different things. And I think you learn more than anything, you learn a lot about yourself and what, what you can do and what you can't do. And you'd be really surprised about what you can do with the right encouragement. That's why I like it. Someone once told me, to be a master means that you're always a student. And we're always learning down here at the dojo. We're learning to teach. We're learning to referee. And we're learning that you're going to have good times and bad times. But no matter what, we get up and we train for tomorrow. <laughs>